from the studios of Umar Channel. You're probably thinking this is normally a recorded programme. Uh, why are we showing it live? Well, we've got a great personality, a great spiritual leader, uh, a great successor of a great spiritual father. Uh, alhamdulillah, it's Umar Channel's greatest honour uh, and privilege to present this close-up programme uh, with the Honourable His Eminence Sheikh Mahmoud uh, Adil Al-Hakani. Uh, you probably guessed by now he's the blessed son and successor uh, of uh, Maulana Sheikh Nazim al Hakani Rahimullah. Um, it seems like only yesterday that the Honorable Blessed Sheikh Nazim Rahmatullahi Ta'ala uh, passed uh, from this world. Uh, he still lives on, as I've said on many occasions uh, on Ummah Channel, he lives on in the hearts of the people who loved him and his message of tolerance, of peace, and love, uh, unconditional love for the Prophet, his family, uh, the Sahaba. Uh, and the message of Sufism, uh, in that message, uh, his legacy lives on for generations to come. Uh, it gives me great honour and great privilege on behalf of the whole team here on my channel to welcome uh, Sheikh uh, Mohammed Adil Halakani. Uh, say the Islam wa alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Wa alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Uh, Sheikh, welcome to my channel. Thank you. Uh, great to have you here. Uh, inshallah, we'll be listening uh, to the honourable message uh, of Kibba Sheikh Saab very, very shortly. Uh, but as we also do, because we from the Ahl Sunnah wal Jamaat, we start uh, with uh, Naat Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Um, and I want to request Irfan Ahmed Naqshbandi al Hakani uh, to come uh, and recite uh, Naat Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. موسیقی میں تجھے رکھ لوں مولانا عادل میں تجھے رکھ لوں اے جل و جانانا عادل میں تجھے رکھ لوں اور کیوں آنکھ ملائی تھی کیوں آنگ لگائی تھی آنکھ ملائی تھی کیوں آگ لگائی تھی اب رخ کو چھپا بیٹھے اب رخ کو چھپا بیٹھے کر کے ہمیں دیوانا آدل میں تجھے رکھ لوں اور جی چاہتا ہے توفے میں بیجوں میں تمہیں آنکھیں جی چاہتا ہے توفے میں بیجوں میں تمہیں آنکھیں درشن کا تو درشن ہو مولانا درشن کا تو درشن ہو اور نظران کا نظرانہ درشن کا تو درشن ہو ہاں درشن کا تو درشن ہو اور نظران کا نظرانہ آدل میں تجھے رکھنوں اور پینے کو تو پی لوں گا پر عرض ذرا سی ہے پینے کو تو پی لوں گا پر عرض ذرا سی ہے کہ قبروس کا نازم ہو ہاں قبروس کا نازم ہو اور بغداد کا مہانا آدل میں تجھے رکھ لوں بے دم میری قسمت میں 
सजदे है इसी दर के बेदम मेरी किस्मत में सजदे है इसी दर के हुआ है हुक्म मुझको मौलाना शेख नाजिम से हुआ है हुक्म मुझको मौलाना शेख नाजिम से के छूटा है ना छूटेगा हाँ छूटा है ना छूटेगा संगे शेख मोहम्मद का छूटा है ना छूटेगा हाँ छूटा है ना छूटेगा संगे मेरे मुर्शद का शेख मोहम्मद का आदिल मैं तुझे रख लू ऐजल वाई जाना ना बेखुद किए देते हैं अल्लाह मसली वसली व Uh, uh, that was Irfan Ahmed Naqshbandi Al Hakani uh, brought a bit of a Naqshbandi rang uh, twist, if you like, uh, to that uh, naat. Jazakallah. Thank you so much uh, for that warm introduction to our program. As I've said, we're live here in the studios of Umma Channel with a very special close-up. And my honourable guest is the honourable Sheikh Mohammed Adil Al Hakani. Uh, he is the blessed son. And the successor uh, of, of the Honourable Sheikh Nazim Al Hakani, Rahimullah. Uh, we will take your calls very, very shortly on zero one two five four two double seven three seven zero. We'll try to get in as many of those calls as possible. So please keep trying, uh, and we will do that very, very shortly. And if you're on Twitter, it's official Umma CH, official Umma CH Sheikh Mohammed on Umma with the hashtag. Uh, Sheikh, uh, very warm welcome once again. Um, how are you coping? How is the family coping without the Physical presence of Maulana. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Thank you for this uh, question. Maulana, he was since two years is uh, away from this world. He was around us, but he was preparing us to these days. But of course, it is not easy uh, for Murit also, the biggest disaster to uh, their Murshid to pass away. So for, he is for us Murshid and he was father, of course, the, our everything, even for last minute, we couldn't uh, accept this uh, so uh, doctor was trying even we said to doctor he won't he don't like to go to hospital but even ho hospital doctor still trying to they try uh, doctor coming from turkey they all 24 hours with him he was a professor but he was like maulana until last uh, minute he was with him and he was saying a very, very good thing. When Maulana, you, you feel he is in unconscious, but until when he is go, going to Akhira, he was making dua and he was smiling. Subhanallah. Subhanallah. But he is in hell. So like this, he uh, went. But of course, it is uh, really uh, tough uh, for us. Uh, it is not easy for everybody also. But uh, Allah, what we will do? Uh, he is inna Allah wa inna ilayhi rajaun. We are, uh, alhamdulillah, we come around this brother uh, with love of them. It is coming uh, better and better. Alhamdulillah. 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 Yeah, for I you all. Sheikh, the message of uh, the Honorable Sheikh Maulana uh, was spirituality, Sufism, the love of the Prophet. Um, 
you're obviously blessed to be his yeah. son from his family. Uh, what was he like in private? Uh, um, I don't understand. Molana Sheikh Nazim, how was he in private, in, in, at home and with the family? Private, uh, Alhamdulillah, he was uh, the best, uh, like uh, his inheritor of Prophet Sallallahu He was everything doing Prophet from Sunnah, from to be polite with people, with us. He was doing this. Even I, when some guests coming, he tried to give him the best uh, for the respecting and for to host them and to be good uh, uh, housekeeper. Is this for guests, for uh, family also same, same. But uh, our. Uh, uh, Our life, Maulana, he was since uh, beginning, is, uh, or he get order to travel around the world. First, because inside uh, Syria and uh, Lebanon and uh, Cyprus, he was traveling. Every three months, going, leaving us. So we, all the time we are uh, missing him. Yes, All the time it was like this, but this time we are missing him. But inshallah, it is long. How uh, life? How it is? How much it is long? It is short. Inshallah, we will meet him again. Yes. We feel like every time he was going to travel, maybe one month, may, sometimes three months away from us. So this also, it will be, inshallah, quickly. We meet them again in uh, Jannah. In I mean, yeah. And he travelled extensively around the world. Of course. And yeah. there are lovers and followers of Maulana uh, in every part of the world. Yes, yes. That's a great achievement. Yes. Every, uh, from every kind of people. Uh, some people you cannot believe uh, this, they're interesting for him. But he, they are, by his uh, spiritual power, they wasn't loving him, even some of them non-Muslim, but still respecting, and they said, we love this man. Subhanallah. Yeah. Subhanallah. Um, Sufism, we have the rise of other groups, but what, what's Sufism? What's Tariqa? Sufism, the heart of Islam. It's not the outing from Islam. The heart, the real uh, sinc sincere people, is only for Allah they are living. From coming from, from Prophet time, Ahl Sufa, they are, was uh, sitting, not doing anything except to pray and to watch Prophet and to uh, keep Quran and Hadith and praying all time. Even they don't have uh, food to eat, Prophet he was sending food for them. There we are coming uh, Sufi from that side. It is not away from Islam, not near Islam, not beside Islam. It is uh, heart of Islam. Subhanallah. Yeah. We try to follow uh, Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and the uh, Islam order. This is Sufi. Sufi is very simply put uh, by the Honorable uh, Sheikh Mohammed uh, Adil Al Hakani. Uh, I don't think I've ever come across anybody who's put it so simply, yeah. uh, ever. Uh, people make it very complicated, but it's quite simple, isn't it? Uh, it uh, this Maulana here, uh, all time like this, simple. <laughs> 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 um, I think at this stage we're going to open the lines and take a few calls and uh, see what people want to say. Obviously keep it brief, 01254 We're broadcast across the world, uh, across North America, Canada, uh, the Middle East and the Far East as well, we have viewers. So wherever you are in the world, if you want to get in touch, 44 And if you're on Twitter, official Ummah, CH, official Ummah, CH, please use the hashtag Sheikh Mohammed on Ummah. Uh, Sheikh, this is your first trip to the UK after the uh, physical passing of, uh, yeah. of Maulana. Yes. Um, how have you found your trip so far? 
Alhamdulillah, it is uh, I, uh, because after many people they said, if Maulana pass away, this tariqa will uh, thousand of sheikh will come. But this is kalam of Maulana. Nobody say I'm sheikh, all except. And everywhere we are going, all people coming. I was in Holland, in Germany also. Everybody, they are uh, accepting. Of course, they are sad, but they are happy to be in Maulana, attend uh, somebody to look for uh, Tariqa and to continue his way, way of uh, Allah, way of Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. And Maulana blessed you with that responsibility to be the successor to take on the tariqa for a new generation. Uh, how difficult is that for, for somebody to take on? Uh, it, it is very difficult. I normally, I am a shy person. I don't like to be around the people, and, uh, but uh, this is order, so we must obey. I am, uh, but I said I don't know, but uh, it is order. Uh, we right. cannot say I'm not happy, I'm not, but uh, because it is order, you must obey this. Uh, once he was saying, if I order you follow this stone, you must uh, f follow him. For this, uh, I am like a stone, so uh, inshallah, <laughs> we will be following his order, and I am. Uh, Difficult, it is difficult, but when he is attending, he, I ensure Allah, Prophet, Mawlana, they will help. Inshallah. This. For this, I am uh, uh, relaxed. SubhanAllah. Huh. Um, I, I think it wouldn't go amiss for me to ask a question about your love and your respect and connection, because you've got a family connection with Sheikh Hisham al Um yeah. Obviously, there will be people out there who will try to put lies out about the tariqa and about your relationship. Um, what are your views about Sheikh Hisham? He's uh, my uh, brother-in-law. Uh, we know him from uh, childhood. So, uh, mashallah, he make uh, very good uh, uh, khidma. We love him, <laughs> Alhamdulillah, he's uh, doing uh, best for to uh, Tariqa and all around the world. He's nearly 70 years old, but uh, is still going around. He's more active, uh, hundred times from me. I don't like to travel too much. But he's, uh, mashallah, long distance. Uh, thank you for him. Uh, Allah, uh, give him more power, more uh, Ameen, Allah, uh, Ameen. Uh, nur uh, to help all uh, people they want to help. Subhanallah. And when you travel around the UK and you, you, you meet people, what, what, how, uh, what message do you give them? What message do you give our viewers watching this? Seeing you for the first time on, on my channel, what would you say to them? We are happy with them. We are trying. There is uh, many, many people there try to show Tariqa bad thing. But no, Tariqa, who following Tariqa, they are following Ahlul Sunnah wal Jama'ah. Because they are loving Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, respecting Prophet, respecting people. Tariqa teaching adab. Uh, da danger thing to be out of Ahl Sunnah wal Jama'ah. Because Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, he was saying to be with Sawad al Azam. We are accepting for Imam, we are accepting all. Sahaba, we are accepting, of course, all uh, awliya Allah, all tariqa who following uh, Ahl Sunnah wal Jama'ah. 
this is what we are trying to say to them and to encourage people to come to Tariqa. Even if not Tariqa, to not be against Tariqa, to be Ahlul Sunnah wal Jama'ah. Because we are all in need for Shafa'ah, Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, who is not respecting and not accepting Shafa'ah, he will not give them. So, if you are away from Prophet, it is so difficult to be in a good position in Akhirah. So difficult. With uh, your acting, so of course, you must be sincere. If only for benefit you do this, not good. You must put love with this acting, not hate. SubhanAllah. Yeah. This is what we try to do. Um, Sheikh, I noticed I was there yesterday in Manchester. I was there in Bury on uh, Thursday. I would say 90% of the people there were under 30. Mashallah. They're all youngsters, Mashallah. you know, people who've left Ahla Sunnah, coming back to Ahla Sunnah. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Um, what would you like to say to, to them people who've gone away or, or trying to get them back? Yeah, inshallah, inshallah, they're, they're uh, cheated people because this is a generation who out of Ahl Sunnah generation, it is a new, maybe 40, 50 years, uh, I think, not more. 1,400 years, there was all Ahl Sunnah. So very few that. people who was outside, and there was very few. And the people, they know them, they're not uh, uh, going to them too much. But this is who out, they, I don't know, of course, Shaitan he put this to take Ahl Sunnah to divide them. But uh, inshallah, uh, they will come back. Inshallah. Yeah. Inshallah. inshallah. Are uh, you watching a live close-up with me, Mohammed Shafiq, live from the studios of Ummah Channel here in Blackburn, United Kingdom? Uh, our honourable guest is the Sheikh Mohammed Adil Al Hakani. Uh, he's the son and successor uh, of the honourable Sheikh Nazim Al Hakani, uh, Rahimullah. Uh, we've opened the lines, and I'm hoping that they're gonna, you're going to tell me uh, that we've got uh, a few calls that we can take. Uh, and if that's okay with you, Sheikh, with of your course, permission, mm -hmm. uh, just take a, a few calls. Uh, so if you want to get in touch with the show, 01254-277-370. And if you're on Twitter, it's official Umma CH, official Umma CH, with the hashtag Sheikh Mohammed on Umma. Uh, so shall we go to the first call? Okay, so we'll, okay, well, well, you'll tell me when there's a call. Um, Sheikh, uh, what was your childhood like, education-wise? Have you, do, do, do you have... Have you done education in terms of outside the, the, the Islamic education? Uh, no. Because uh, after primary school, we went to madrasa in Damascus. SubhanAllah. Yeah. In Damascus? Damascus, yeah. SubhanAllah. Uh, let's, if you see Jaza, I'll, I'll take a call? Yes. Yeah, so okay, cool. let's take our first call of the show. Asalaamu Alaikum, you're live on my channel. Wa Alaikum Asalaam wa Rahmatullahi Ta'ala Hello, Asalaamu Alaikum. And my love... Uh, Hello. Deepest. Asalaamu Alaikum, can you hear me? Okay, I can't hear anything. Maulana, he was, uh, every time, uh, he was so pity. He said, I study university, I study high school. Study, and when he was studying this, nobody studying even uh, first school, primary school. But he was, uh, Pity said, I waste all these years for nothing. For so to not to study uh, without uh, another uh, school. It is, uh, I think, for some people, no need. For some people, need. Who is, they can 
uh, clever and to study, they can study. But some, nowadays, people, they forcing children, you must study, you must study, you must study. This is wrong. Uh, let's take that call. Salam alaikum, you're live on my channel. Uh, yes, brother, what's your name? Where are you calling from? My name is Muhammad Hussein Azam from Wolverhampton. Uh, welcome. What would you like to say? To I'd show? like to say Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuh, ya Sayyidi wa Murshidi. Wa alaikum salam. Sayyidi, I pass on lovingly and in great humbleness and love and other the salam of everybody from our local area and extended areas to yourself and they are very very happy alhamdulillah to have your blessed presence within the uk within the 40 days of sultan veiling themselves from us and we'd like to thank you from the bottom of our hearts for quenching out this ya sayidi <laughs> thank you very much thank and sayidi we alhamdulillah are alhamdulillah honored that you are on umar channel and i also thank umar channel for showing great love and adab for our blessed sheikh and that may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala allow us to be under your servicehood with sincerity and love and adab. And we ask you, Ya Sayyidi, as I used to ask Maulana, to forgive us as we are weak and allow us to be under your feet yes, and sir. allow us to be under your servicehood, inshallah, from now, endlessly, inshallah, with your blessings. Thank you, thank you so much. Jazakallah, thank you very much. Um, we're, well, the lines are open, so if you want to get in touch, uh, please do try and keep it message brief. We'll get through. Uh, as we do, it's time for our break. When we come back, we'll carry on the discussion with the Honourable Sheikh. Uh, we'll take more of your calls uh, and then we'll finish off with a bit of zikr and give you a bit of a Naqshbandi zikr uh, Hakani uh, twist, if you like, to the show. And then we'll finish off with a bit of Salat Islam as well. Join me on the other side of this. Assalamu alaikum, welcome back to Close Up with me, Mohammed Shafiq, live from the studios of Ummah Channel. Yes, we are live from the studios of Ummah Channel. As you may know, this program uh, is a recorded program, but today we're live because the Honorable Sheikh Mohammed Adil al Hakani, the successor and the Honorable son of Sheikh Nazim al Hakani, uh, has blessed the United Kingdom uh, with his presence. And we felt, uh, because Ummah Channel has a long connection uh, with the Honorable Sheikh, uh, that we wanted to bring you a special program with the Honourable Sheikh, um, as we did uh, when the Sheikh uh, left this uh, physical world. Uh, we broadcast that nine-hour uh, program here on Umar Channel, showing in the funeral. So there's a lot of love out there. Let's take, uh, if it's okay with you, Sheikh, we'll take some calls and then come back and talk about uh, Damascus and a couple of other things. Is of that course, okay? Sir. Shukran. Uh, let's go to the next call. Assalamu alaikum. You're live on Umar Channel. Wa alaikum assalam. Yes, you brother. Me? What's your name? Where are you calling from? My name is Arsan, I'm calling from Birmingham. Uh, welcome brother, what would you like to say? Um, just um, would like to give my salam to uh, Sayyidi Sheikh Mohammed. Wa alaikum salam. Yeah, Sayyidi, um, so it was very sad to hear about um, your father and our beloved Sheikh Sultan of Oliya, Sheikh Nazim. Thank you. And inshallah I'll be seeing you on Wednesday inshallah in Wolverhampton and Birmingham. Thank you, inshallah. Yeah. Thank you very much. Yes, I think Birmingham is on Wednesday. Uh, you're travelling from the north and gradually making your way down uh, <laughs> south until you end up uh, hopefully in London. Yes. Um, we were just talking before the break about uh, Damascus. You studied in Damascus. Yeah, we was uh, born in Tam Damascus oh, also. Oh, Yeah, we finished uh, primary school. After Maulana, he put me in uh, madrasa. Because Maulana, he was uh, saying for... Damascus ulama, they are, have taqwa. SubhanAllah. Taqwa, what meaning? Meaning, they teaching you with what you learn to be, uh, to be uh, fair from Allah, from to do what you're doing, you must know you are with Allah. And this madrasa, it was uh, strongest. 
12 months uh, studying, no holiday. So, so I studied three years. It was uh, more, but something uh, happened. But the three years, it was enough for uh, uh, maybe for university. I was 15, 16 year old when I finished. I couldn't, uh, something, uh, it was war and something, we couldn't uh, continue. In Madrasa, there was uh, many foreigner uh, students, Turkish, from uh, Russia or from other places, many from Africa also. Uh, it was very good uh, uh, teaching with uh, the owner, he was Shazili also. <coughs> Alhamdulillah, we, we are happy to uh, be in this madrasa. And there, uh, really, each one, like professor, was very few uh, students, but each one, uh, teacher, they are uh, the biggest Alim sure. in Damascus. They were teaching us uh, hadith, Quran, tafsir, all uh, only uh, knowledge of uh, Islam. Only because it is enough for us. Many people. After this, they went to study in Arab country. Alhamdulillah, we are uh, non-Arab people because we are loving Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. We are loving Arab. But Arab, they don't, uh, most of them, because they don't know Nema favor what they have. Allah Akbar. Prophet from Arab. But they are not uh, knowing this uh, favor. And uh, non Arab, when they saw one Arab man or each one, they thought he is like saint. What he say, he is, it is uh, real. But most of them, they are even not believe in saint, not to believe in awliya, not to believe in Rijalullah. For these people, they are cheated, who uh, many of ulama of Sham, they was, of course, they are awliya even. But from other Countries, we don't want to say a name of country. Mm -hmm. It is uh, since 50 years changing this. Because now more uh, uh, easy to go around the world and more easy to see people. They cheated by this. No, uh, uh, Allah Azza wa Jalla, He is no different between Arab and non-Arab, only by love of Prophet, by, by taqwa, innama akramakum atqakum, in akramakum and Allah atqakum. Ayat, this is. No uh, different between. For this, don't uh, be cheated by who is not respect Prophet, not respect awliya Allah, uh, who is respect this, he is more valuable in front of Allah from other. Sure. And many scholar, many uh, ulama, they are coming from non-Arab since a thousand year old from Mabar and Nahar. They make khidma for, why they make this? Because they love Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. They, if they have one Sahabi in their country, 
they said for him Sultan. Like in Istanbul, Ayyub Sultan, they said. Where uh, to Cyprus, Hala Sultan, they said. This was why they praising. And Allah, happy with them, help them, and make them whole uh, time help them. High and high. Um, I'm just going to take one more final call yeah. and then uh, we'll move on to the next stage of the program. Let's go to Wolverhampton and talk to Asim Khan. Asalaamu Alaikum Asim. Wa Alaikum Asalaam wa Rahmatullahi wa Barakatuh. Welcome to the show brother. Sorry to keep you waiting there. Uh, what would you like to say? Inshallah, uh, I just wish, wish to give salam to our beloved Shaykh. Asalaamu Alaikum Ya Sayyidi. Wa Alaikum Asalaam wa Rahmatullahi wa Sayyidi, oh, from all the lovers, um, all, all my family, friends, everybody in the Murid of Wolverhampton, we, we love you and we are eagerly awaiting you, Inshallah, to see you on Wednesday. Inshallah, you are in our hearts and may we always be in your heart, Sayyidi. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Uh, Asim Khan was our final call. Uh, and if you want to come and see the Sheikh, you can see him uh, tonight if you're in Keithley, West Yorkshire, which is just up the road. And um, you can also uh, go to Birmingham on Wednesday. Um, and gradually as you get, and think on Thursday, they'll be in Peckham. Thursday in Peckham. And it's also uh, uh, the 40th. Uh, uh, day of, of, of yes. Maulana's physical uh, yes. passing yeah. from this world yes. and, and, and big more day than a big gathering in, in, in Peckham Inshallah, Inshallah. Um, I, I, just, I, just, I just think Sheikh if it's okay with you that we, uh, we've got about 10 minutes left and I wanted to just do 5 minutes of Naqshbandi uh, uh, Zikr so that people can see uh, what they will get if they come out and see you ok Bismillahirrahmanirrahim فعلم أنه لا إله إلا الله 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 محمد رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم إلى شرف النبي صلى الله عليه وسلم وآله وأصحابه الكرام وإلى أرواح مشايخنا أبائنا وماتنا وصديقينا لله تعالى الفاتحة ألا بذكر الله تطمئن القلوب بلا يا الله 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 Allah, 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 Hi, 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 hi,
هاي حسبنا الله ونعم الوكيل نعم المولى ونعم النصير غفرانك ربنا وإليك المصير اللهم صل على محمد وعلى آل محمد وسلم 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 صل يا رب وسلم على جميع الأنبياء والمرسلين وآل كل أجمعين والحمد لله رب العالمين على أشرف العالمين سيدنا محمد الصلوات على أفضل العالمين سيدنا محمد الصلوات على أكمل العالمين سيدنا محمد الصلوات صلوات الله تعالى وملائكته وأنبيائه ورسله وجميع خلقه على محمد وعلى آل محمد عليه وعليهم السلام ورحمة الله تعالى وبركاته ورضي الله تبارك وتعالى عن ساداتنا أصحاب رسول الله أجمعين وعن التابعين بهم بإحسان وعن الأئمة المجتهدين الماضين وعن العلماء المتقين وعن الأولياء الصالحين وعن مشايخنا في الطريقة النقشبندية العالية قدس الله تعالى أرواحهم الزكية ونور الله تعالى أضرحتهم المباركة وأعاد الله تعالى علينا من بركاتهم وفيوضاتهم دائما والحمد لله رب العالمين الفاتحة Thank you so much. You. Uh, that's a taster, alhamdulillah, of the Naqshbandi al-Hakani uh, zikr. Well, it's zikr of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, but uh, alhamdulillah, there's different ways of doing that zikr. So if you want to uh, meet the Honorable Sheikh uh, tonight in Keithley, West Yorkshire, around uh, 7.30 this evening, um, and Birmingham as well. But I'm sure there's details uh, of the poster on the Ummah channel uh, Twitter account. Uh, we're going to finish... Uh, we've got about four minutes left, so we're going to finish uh, with a bit of Salat Islam by uh, my good brother Sheikh Shabir uh, Mughal uh, from Rochdale, and then we'll do Dua with the Sheikh, and then we'll say our goodbyes. So Sheikh Shabir Mughal, sir. <laughs> Shahi Hardo Alam 
صدقہ امام آزم استو فیل شیخ نازم دور ہو سبی کے رنج و غم یا نبی سلام علیکہ یا رسول سلام علیکہ یا حبیب سلام علیکہ سلوات اللہ علیکہ This place, the work that we do here on my channel for the Ummah. Thank you. Maulana, he was uh, every time saying must do something for people to see and to look. Even he was uh, make, many times making a small paper, newspaper. He try, Alhamdulillah, you do what he likes to, to do. بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والصلاة والسلام على رسولنا محمد صيد الأولين والآخرين آمين اللهم اجعل جمعنا هذا جمعا مغفورا وتفرقنا بعده تفرق معصوم ولا تجعل فينا شقيا ولا محرومة اللهم يسر أمورنا اللهم يسر أمورنا اللهم يسر أمورنا يسر أمور هذه المجموعة الإسلامية يا الله انصرهم افتح لهم فتحا مبينا أعطيهم أكثر وأكثر إن شاء الله خدمتهم تصل إلى كل الدنيا ربنا آتنا في الدنيا حسنة وفي الآخرة حسنة وقنا عذاب النار رب اجعلني مقيم الصلاة ومن ذرية ربنا تقبل دعاء اللهم يا مفتح الأباب افتح لنا خير الباب افتح لنا باب رحمة كرمك يا أكرم الأكرمين ارحمنا يا الله واعف عنا واغفر لنا يا الله واجعلنا من عبادك الصالحين من الذين لا خوف عليهم ولا هم يحزنون اجعلنا على صراطك المستقيم اللهم ثبتنا على الحق اللهم ثبتنا على الحق اللهم ثبتنا على الحق وصلى الله على نبي الامي وعلى اله وصحبه وسلم الحمد لله رب العالمين الفاتحه Sheikh thank you so much for coming and being my guest it's been an absolute honor uh, for us here on my channel and, and thank you so much once again thank you uh, for coming normal and uh, not like to come, um, but uh, when somebody invites, you must. Uh, Subhanallah, we are blessed. Thank Alhamdulillah. you. Alhamdulillah, Jazakallah, thank Alhamdulillah. you so much. You are uh, my uh, younger bro brother, so I'm happy. Uh, thank you so much. Like uh, to have uh, Shukran ya Sayyidi. Uh, thank you so much once again to the Honorable Sheikh Mohammed Adil Al Hakani. He's the successor. Uh, and the Honourable Son of Maulana Sheikh Nazim al -Hakani. As I've said, Ummah Channel has a long connection uh, with the great uh, Sheikh of Cyprus. And uh, it is through his blessings and prayers uh, that we are here today. So we're very grateful uh, to the Honourable Sheikh and his family for the blessings that we've received. Wherever you are watching this around the world, thank you so much for joining us. Until next time, take care of yourself and each other. Goodbye. Assalamu alaikum. <laughs>